Howdy folks, coming at you from the heartland of Alberta with an update on my pandemic project. 1980, 17 foot, off road, off grid, if necessary, bug out bowler. Uh, the bowler's been treated to a full frame, mated to the old bowler frame with front and rear extensions. It sits on a 6,000 pound axle. Up on the roof we've got a UFO antenna, max air roof vent, reversible, 195 watt compact solar panel with uh, 240 watt LEDs on the sides. There's two 48 watt LEDs in the front and rear. On the back of the trailer is another 190 watt compact solar panel. It's a digital charge controller inside with about 300 amp per hours batteries. Works great. Up in the front we've added on a couple boxes. The one is the outdoor kitchen. The other one holds the uh, RV barbecue, some tools and uh, battery for the front mounted winch. Comes in handy to pull yourself into campsite nose first sometimes. Added a heavy duty front steering wheel on it, uh, got a handle on it that it can connect to the winch and uh, pull her wherever you want and makes it real easy to maneuver in and out of campsites. Got three propane bottles, two 30 pounders and a 20 pounder for the front. RV barbecue mount is tucked inside there, the handle for the uh, front steering wheels tucked inside. This is a repurposed uh, tree stand comes in real handy. Helps secure the propane bottles, gives you an extra place to store some gear. And then the front part, flip, or the top part flips out and uh, helps secure the, the beach umbrella and uh, or a good place to hang tarps off of or dry your laundry, whatever. Take you around here. Put on a handle for us old folks. Out in the back we got uh, Marine plywood deck also. It's been a uh, really heavy duty extension underneath. Heavy duty stabilizer jacks. Uh, inside the large box we got a 15 gallon uh, sprayer tank. That's part of our solar water system. The heat exchanger is on top of the tank. Grab the energy from the sun, heat it up really nice. Got our other solar panel up top. On the back we got uh, repurposed the uh, front bull bar off a truck and uh, it's a good place to store the spare tire, hang the LED lights, got some hooks in the back for yanking around of spots. Enough room in the back deck for two mountain bikes comfortably, they just snug right in there. In the side box we have the uh, the shower system, the pump for the shower, the three switches on the side, one's for the small pump in the solar, hot water heater, the circulating pump, the other one's for the sprayer pump on the tank, and the other one's for the shower head. Over on this side, nothing much has changed other than I uh, had a hard time finding a uh, bathroom vent, so I got a hood scoop to fit, fit it on there, not too bad. <laughs> For now, otherwise, had her out for her first trip and she performed pretty good. Had a little sway problem, but uh, fixed that up with the sway link and battery power never went below 12.5. We're running computers and projection TV and worked good. So I'll get uh, I'll get her all opened up for you and give you a view of what she looks like when she's ready for camping. Till then, enjoy your day. Talk to you soon.